背負い投げ、背負い落とし、浮き落とし、払い腰、金腰、大外狩り、小外狩り、小外掛け、大外車、内股すかし、秘密返し、巴投げ、瓦返し、カニバサリ、山嵐、浮き技、小内狩り、大内狩り、肩車、横車、釣り込み腰、袖釣り込み腰、払い釣り込み足、ツバメ返し、抱き分かれ。Okay, uh... You should feel blessed in page 85、um, because I'm actually going to make a full production video instead of a direct camera upload、um, for you. That's kind of a big deal.、Um, well, no, actually, it's not. Probably not to you. However, it means you actually got me thinking. And,、uh, You made me do some reading, and I've got other things going on, so I've, I've been pretty busy. Anyways,、uh, I'm gonna, I, I would make more pleasantries, but、uh, I only have 10 minutes, and I've got a lot to say.、Um, first, perhaps I haven't watched all of your videos, and maybe you do、um, credit some of your sources, but in academic circles, it's rather rude、um, not to. Credit your sources, okay? So,、um, if you'd like mention who these papers are by and stuff, I wouldn't have to kind of figure out what you're talking about and then post it into Google and track down the papers and read them for myself. And you're, you're drawing a lot from other people, and then you're not really giving them credit, and plus, you're not really taking their arguments at face value, you know, and just kind of repeating them. Um, like a parrot, you're kind of adding your own spin to things. And、uh, that, that's fine, but I mean, at least credit your sources. You, you know, I mean, it just makes it easier for other people to, to research what exactly you're talking about. Okay,、um, <clears throat> what I got caught up on for a couple of days and I was trying to work through、um, was actual qualia issue you were talking about. And. What I found most interesting, I found really, really intriguing, was qual e, which is like an individual unit of qualia, okay? And I, I, I was like, well, where is this in the neuron? And I got real caught up in that. And then、uh, today, on, on, when I was on a break, what I did was I、uh, go, well, I'm approaching this wrong. I need to look and Look at a good diagram of a neuron, figure out what's going on, and I notice something. A neuron is either on or off. So it's more like a computer than I actually thought it was.、Uh, however, with like a transistor, for example, you have your anode, cathode, and then,、uh, god damn it, anode, cathode. It's been a long time since I've been in electronics school. Anyways,、uh, you have basically two inputs and one output. Okay, and then you can adjust frequency. Well, it, it's different with an actual neuron.、Um, you have a hundred billion, I, I believe that's the right number, a hundred billion neurons in your brain and a hundred trillion synapses. And that's the dendrites, the den yeah, dendrites that kind of branch and sprout off this one neuron. So, this is a very, very complex thing when it comes to brain chemistry. So, it was like, I don't want to spend a lot more time. He's going to think、I've, he scared me off, you know, and terrified me. So, what I did was, I'm like, well, I'll try to approach it from the philosophy side, okay? And I think that was the best way to do it because it didn't take that long before I found this gentleman,、uh, Dennis Nicholson, okay? Who had addressed this issue, and basically、um, he put in terminology you will probably appreciate because I'm guessing you're a philosophy major. However, I'm not positive.、Um, but he boiled it down into like, more your terms. Although he did not use subjective experience.、Um, I'm still trying to find that video of yours, by the way, where you define what you mean by subjective experience.、Uh, However, he did talk about experience quite a bit and why it can be a physical thing. And I, I'm actually glad I ran into you and、uh, we brought all this up.、Um, to catch up others、um, before I go into this kind of philosophical, philosophical, sorry, sometimes、uh, my enunciation and pronunciation is not great.、Um, before we go into this 
philosophical debate. I want to get people up to speed with what's going on, but I also have an extract from this Dennis Nicholson I want to read. So, um, anyways, you know, bring me, bring me Muhammad, bring me Squeaky, Squeaky, make him squeak, you know, make him squeak. Anyways, uh, we're talking about qualia, and qualia is. You see him? He's red. You hear him? He squeaks. You can't see my dog, and I'm not going to move my camera around because I always think that's kind of a cheesy effect. But my dog is fuzzy. He feels soft. He feels nice. Okay? We're not talking about consciousness because uh, I, I think somebody else talked to Mr. Page about that, or NP Page 85, I mean. If that is your real name. If you're like me, and I know I am, I appreciate usernames without any, you know, numbers in them. But anyways. Um, so anyways, qualia is like, like feelings and like seeing something red. Uh, that, that's a real common philosophical thing. Um, there's the whole Mary in the black and white room. I am digressing. That is a monkey on my back. I'm going to stop here and uh, launch directly into the quote from this guy because I don't want it to seem like I'm dodging issues and whatnot and I don't know how long I've been filming.